What's up YouTube? Welcome back to yet another Pokemon trading card game unboxing and pack opening and for today as you can tell on the left side as I hit the paper I did not mean to do that we have the point system so that means another pack battle so we have one point for reverse rare two points for hollow rare and or evolution seeker rare three points for EX GX mega EX four lovely points for full art Five amazing points if we pull a normal secret rare and or a hyper rare because yes, we will be opening up sun and moon today So who are we pack battling? Well, we are pack battling no other than DDJ916 so he has a great channel make sure you guys do go check his channel out uh, He makes Yu-Gi-Oh! Pokemon content uh, Other stuff as well like one punch man minifigures all different stuff uh, he streams, he does so much great content, so link will be in the description down below. Make sure you guys go check out his channel. So it will be a point system, obviously we showed you the point system for a reason, uh, because there, this is a point system. But also let us know in the comments down below who you thought won. Maybe he, I pull a secret rare or hyper rare and he pulls, I don't know, three full arts or some crazy. And you think the secret rare is better. Let us know in the comments down below just in case we tie. And or I want to hear your guys' opinion. Make sure you go check out his channel and tell him I sent you. And smash that like sub, hit that subscribe button, and that is awesome. And if you're coming from his channel, hey guys, welcome to my channel. I know we were talking really fast for, you know, a good, good solid minute and a half. Uh, but that's just because I want to make this video a little bit faster. Uh, but let's get right into what we're going to be opening up today. We are opening up no other than the so amazing Lunalatin. I have this video on my channel uh, already, so if you haven't seen that, make sure you guys go do it. It'll be in the description and or in the playlist. This is the Lunala tin. It came of one of two tins, uh, Lunala and then a Solgaleo tin, which I've opened up both. Uh, but on my channel right now, you only have the Lunala one. I have not released the Solgaleo one yet. But let's get cracking into this tin and we'll do a kind of... Uh, I know these... Gotta remember, these ones are really, really hard to open. Uh, they take some, you know, good finesse because they used really, really good plastic on these actual tins. So let's get into this oh, amazing tin. So it was completely sealed, and this is what the tin looks like on the front. Like I said, we have the awesome, super cool Lunala. We have all the energies. We have Lunala once again. We have the Pokemon trading card game, trademarked. And we have the Soul Galio on the other side there. This is what the back looks like. Remember guys, you have to be of the age of six or else the Pokemon will eat you alive. That's what the beautiful barcode looks like. And this is what it comes with. It comes with one of two awesome promos. One being Soul Galio and the other one being Lunala. They are the same as the playset. Uh, the ones from the actual packs themselves. And then you get four packs. So let's crack this beautiful Alolan tin right open and take a look at the goodies inside. I don't know what I'm doing. So, like we said, we have the Lunala promo. Let's pop it out. These tins are like one of the first tins that uh, actually pop out really, really awesome and amazingly easy. Uh, I am out of perfect fit sleeves. So we are gonna use the Lunala sleeves, which is perfectly fitting for the Lunala tin. So that's what you get. You get the Lunala promo. Set that off in the back. Uh, it comes with the code card to unlock the Lunala tin. It also comes with four booster packs, which two are Sun and Moon. One is Evolutions and one is Breakthrough. So those are the packs that it comes with. And you get an awesome cool Lunala tin to add to your collection. Uh, these tins are not very good at storing cards. I'm just gonna put that out there. If you guys haven't opened up a tin before, they're not the best at storing cards. I will put Lunala over in the corner over here, just so you can see Lunala's pretty shiny little face. And you get the four packs. So we have Decidueye. We have a Lunala to fit with the Lunala. We have an Evolutions, and we have a Breakthrough. So we're gonna go ahead and do a sandwich here of Breakthrough, Sun and Moon, Sun and Moon, and Evolutions. Again, this is a point system. But again, we want to know what you guys think as the viewers, what you guys want to see. Uh, we'll open up Breakthrough first because it is just a fantastic set, and I love Breakthrough, but let's just get Breakthrough over with. And uh, make sure you go check out uh, DDJ's 916 videos. 
Like I said, he has great videos. Uh, he's kind of a smaller channel, but that's okay because we all start from somewhere. Uh, and if you're coming from his channel, welcome to my channel. I'm so glad you guys are here. Uh, please think about hitting that subscribe button. It would really mean a lot to me if you did. Uh, let's get into our first pack. So we have three and two. Uh, Breakthrough has treated me well in the past. Uh, I've gotten many, many Mews before. Uh, so uh, we got many Mews. That's kind of weird to say. We have a chest pin. Hopefully it's pretty good focused. I hope everything's good for you guys. I'm filming this at night. I normally film during the day so that way the sunlight, uh, natural light. We have a Woobat, a Rufflet, another chest pin. So let's take a look at both chest pins in the set. Very, very cool that we have two chest pins here in this set of Breakthrough. What? No way, guys. Has that ever happened to you? We have the trifecta of chess pins. So if you're ever curious what chess pin is in the set, oh, even, even better, guys. We have four chess pins. Look at this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I have never seen this before. This is a first for me I've ever seen. That is very, very cool. We have the three chess pins. What a pack. We have the Starmie. See if I can get it to focus a little bit better for you guys. We have the Starmie. We have the Curlia. Parallel City. Our reverse is a reverse Pikachu. Very, very nice reverse. And our rare is going to be a non hollow rare Smurgle. Smeargle. Wow, that was kind of anticlimactic with that uh, Smeagol pack. Or, uh, yeah, Smeagol. Let us go right into evolutions. I know I said I'd do sun and moon, but let's just get evolutions out of the way. Uh, another great set. Um, evolutions, what do we want? We want that Mega Charizard full art. I would lose my mind. You have no idea, guys. Obviously, Mega Charizard is my mascot. Is this cards upside down? Interesting. Very, very inter... Yeah, look at this. Do you guys see this? Look at that. This pack is all messed up. So one, two, three, and two. So all the, ooh, look how bad that is. You guys see that? Oh my gosh, let's get it focused in on the card and not the background. Look at that, and look at these cards. They're all upside down. So we're gonna flip them. Some weird stuff going on with evolutions. This is, wow, this is terrible. Evolutions, man. What happened? I thought you guys were, re you know, made pretty good. Uh, we have Onyx, Growlithe, Onyx, a Nidoran. I'm all over the place because I am just in shock right now. Poliwag, Unlisted Leaf Energy, a Coughing, Misty's Determination, Revive, a Reverse Fighting Energy, which is a thumbs up in my book because I love these cards, and a Rare is a far-fetched. I'm kind of glad it wasn't anything too great because that card is beat up like really really bad. I'm like going in between of auto-focused and not auto-focused because there's too much going on in the background right now. Uh, I don't know why it, it's being very weird and not focusing on what I need it to focus on. But let's get into Sun and Moon. We all know how Sun and Moon is. It is a awesome set but it's a very very hard set to complete. Because there's so many ultra rares and the set is very, very mean. It is a mean set as in it doesn't give you very good pulls most of the time. Uh, we have no points, guys. This is pretty sad. Two, three, four. My luck has been uh, pretty, pretty bad over the course of the last couple days. If you guys have not watched all of my other videos, yeah, it's not the greatest. Uh, I'm not saying I didn't pull anything great, but overall it's not been the greatest compared to my previous luck. We have a Fomantis Muril, we have a Skarmory, a Poliwag, a Sandy Gast, Psychic Energy, Poison Barb, Torah Cat, a Trainer Potion, and a Lowland Persian as our reverse, and our rare of the first Sun and Moon pack is... A non hollow rare Stoutland. Wow, guys. This is very, very interesting that we have not pulled a single thing. Wow. DJ, DDJ, whatever you, you want to call yourself. Man, 
I hope you have so much better luck than I do. If I don't pull anything from this Sun and Moon pack, I am just going to rage quit. I'm going to be honest, I'm going to rage quit out of here. I'm going to walk off and just leave the video the way it is. This is insane that I have not pulled a single thing whatsoever. Let's see if we can make it up on this last pack of Sun and Moon. Lunala, bless us with the moon. We are opening it up at night. You have to give us a blessing here. We have a Stuffle, a Marini, a Dupider, a Bonsuit, a Lillipup, Electric Energy, how are you guys doing? Passimian, Rotom Dex, a Reverse Uncommon Boldor, and our rare last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? And a Tauros GX. So we did get a GX. So that is three points on the board. But wow, guys, what a awful tin. Well, I guess it wasn't that bad, but it wasn't that great either. So let's throw some sleeves on all these cards here and uh, do a quick recap of all the stuff we pulled. Whew, what a interesting, interesting video. Nothing really, really crazy was pulled in the making of this video, but we have a reverse, not <laughs> reverse, we have a normal non-hollow rare Stoutland, a far-fetched non-hollow rare, we have a Smeagol non-hollow rare, we have a reverse uncommon Boldor, and a lowland Persian uncommon, and we have a common Pikachu. We have a reverse or foil energy. We have our first hit of the bo uh, 10. We have the Taurus GX and the Lunala. So we only have three points from this video. Thank you guys so much for coming out. I really do appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe to both of our channels. Check both videos out. Let us know in the comments everyone. And that is it. Three points. Have a fantastic day.